Okay, let's wrap up the program with a few minutes conversation about the new trading week. What do you expect to be the trading theme this week? I have one. That's the earnings. Bittersweet. Yes, 7 Up is still sweet, but the numbers from last year wasn't sweet to investors. The company suffered about 4 billion naira net loss. That was quite significant. From Honeywell Flower and a few others, let's get Chukuma Anyawu, who is the head of research at um, GTI Capital, to talk, GTI Securities, I beg your pardon, to talk to us for one or two minutes. Um, Chukuma, it's good to see you on the program. Hope you had a nice weekend. I did both, and it's great to be here. Yes, you did. So you, the last time you tasted 7-Up, uh, the Spice, whatever, it's still sweet, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yes, it was the last time I, I tasted 7-Up. But the numbers wasn't sweet as far as investors are concerned. If I bought the shares, I'm not sure I would be happy with $4 billion. That's not tasty. That's not sweet. No, it isn't. And it's even particularly worrying because as, as, as we speak now, it's the only um, food, I mean, the only... Um, Bottling kind company of product in its yes. market segment uh, since after the delisting of, of Nigeria by bottling company. So yeah, it, it's not it's, it wasn't a very good result, and of course, um, a lot of the issues were associated with the economy, uh, like we see it both. Of. Yes, the economy is one thing that a number of Nigerians are protesting right now as we speak, starting the first full business week in February on the streets of Lagos, Abuja, and elsewhere, saying they want a better way of handling the economy because of the recession. And again, if you look at what the 2016 was and what the numbers will be seeing, more of it this week will be all about 2016, the state of the economy. Absolutely. It would be a very, um, a very watered down performance by a lot of the companies and this is expected from investors you know we're just looking forward for a, a better 2017 uh, and when first quarters uh, first quarter numbers come in we expect that uh, we'll see some marginal improvement with uh, in line with an improvement in the economy of course yes we've seen a number of consensus uh, uh, uh thank you very much chukuma Ayawo from uh, head of research at uh, gti securities we thank you for your time today we've seen a number of consensus saying nigeria's economy would come out of recession in 2017 from the world bank from the imf and a number of investment and securities financial analysts in nigeria this numbers show a bit of a gentle recovery in 2017.